Here's this abandoned farm again. This was either the Jake Heil farm or was the like the Bud or Butch Lamb farm. Here's the silo here. Yeah, I've always wondered what the what these silos are made out of. Is that concrete? Yeah, that looks like concrete. It is concrete. Yeah. Yeah, that's concrete. I was always wondering what they were made out of. Whenever you see a group of trees, you know there, there was a house there at one time. There's some houses there. It looks like they were going to move them at one time, like 15, 20 years ago, but they never did. Not sure why. Plans fell through. Who knows what happened? This is Colorado Boulevard right here. Right there is Highway 66. That's actually considered Mead up there. I think this is actually considered Town of Firestone. I don't know, these little cities, they keep annexing, annexing so many acres. It's ridiculous. For example, Johnstown. Johnstown used to be a little tiny town. Now they have annexed clear to Highway 34 and I-25. Over by Loveland. So these little towns are kind of annexing as much as they can I guess for taxes they like to collect taxes but they I don't know what they do with their taxes I think the I think the people the, the government line their pockets pockets with it because it seems like they never do anything the streets are bad condition everything is in bad condition they don't improve the infrastructure This is like a little old barn that's been abandoned. But the main house was right over there. I don't want to go over there. I don't want anybody to see me, but we can actually go into this little barn. Seems to be a lot of styrofoam. I don't know where the styrofoam comes from. I don't know if the wind, if it just collects here from the wind, who knows? There's a stack of hay right there. You wonder what kind of animals of what were here. This is an old structure. Look at the wood. Still in good condition, the wood. There's no really no rot. Tractor tires there, old tractor tires. They're still farming this land here. I don't know when they're going to stop farming. Probably fairly soon because they're going to start building houses here. Colorado Boulevard. A lot of traffic anymore. Here's an old couch. I wonder. I bet you local people kind of bring out their trash over here. I don't know. Maybe they bring it out, leave it over here. Or I guess it could have been from the house. Who knows? Old tractor tires. It's like an old sink countertop. You know what I see when I see these old abandoned houses, I think about you know their kids, their kids grew up here, they their little children were born and 
they love their little kids they grew up and the little kids moved out and the years pass by so quickly it's unbelievable seems like your kids are young and then all, all of a sudden they're 20 and they're ready to fly the coop oh it's this old basketball look at this old basketball hoop really cool really cool the flight 629 most of it landed out over, over here south of the pile farm I know I keep saying that but I just want to keep reiterating how important this is and you know this is uh, another guy I want to make a shout out to is Rick Tittle lives in uh, Johnstown and I agree with Rick this is kind of sacred ground where 44 people lost their lives it's just tragic look at this old place here there's an old hose the trees are still beautiful here there's uh, blue spruces other kind of spruce trees I don't know if that's an Engelman spruce maybe it's a blue spruce but this one is definitely a blue spruce over here there's a Russian olive there I don't know what this is this kind of looked like it was a chicken coop just like I mean people lived here they enjoyed their days here they lived their life here had kids farm the farm it's just amazing how time flies one day you're just enjoying life, enjoying your kids grow up, and then one day you're old and ready to throw in the towel. <laughs> if you can see there, that's part of the foundation of the house. It had a basement. I don't want to get too close. I don't want anybody to call the cops on me. That's all I need is the cops on me. Here's that old house. Long gone. I don't know what happened to it. I don't know if it... I wonder if they just took it off. I wonder if they just took it off the foundation and it just ended up over there. Who knows? Well, was that a garage over there? Must, that must have been like a garage there, huh? Carport? Let's take a look over here. Still growing corn, they grew corn this summer. Looks like this might have been a chicken coop. Makes you wonder where these people are. I'm sure their kids are still alive. 
I'm sure the parents are probably gone by now. Old or gone. That's a dairy over there. I think that's called Aurora Dairy. All right, take care.